this is uh, Dr. Eric Yonish from MD Anderson Cancer Center, where I'm professor of medicine, and I'm going to talk about brain metastases and renal cell carcinoma. The first question is, are there symptoms that could be early indicators of brain metastases? I would say here, headaches, any type of change in thinking, uh, headaches, especially in the morning, are, are indicators that you need to tell your doctor about. Next is, should a patient with newly diagnosed renal cell carcinoma have a brain MRI? If you do have metastatic disease elsewhere, it's a very good idea to get a baseline brain MRI. The next question is, should you get these on a regular basis? The NCCN guidelines do recommend that these be done more or less on an annual basis because you can have slowly growing brain metastases that are not symptomatic. And if you catch them early, you can intervene in a much more effective manner. And what are the best modalities? You know, stereotactic radio surgery, which is a form of pinpoint radiation, has revolutionized how we treat these. You're capable of eradicating these pretty much with a high percentage of, of efficacy without having to operate. And this is a one-day treatment. It's really changed this from being a very, very onerous situation to one we can manage and continue treating the rest of the body. And in terms of drug treatments, we actually don't have a lot of data here yet. We know that when you use a drug like cabozantinib or lenvatinib, you might be slowing down the growth or decreasing the size of some of these lesions, but there are clinical trials that are currently underway at MD Anderson uh, and others that are going to be opening that are going to really more formally answer this question in the future. So bottom line here, get brain MRIs at baseline if you have metastatic disease, get them on a regular basis. Radiation therapy with focus beam radiation is an excellent treatment for the majority of individuals with this, and we're working on coming up with better ways to treat it. Thank you.